Oh man, one of my favorite like uh, some it was like some old like comedy band kind of thing, but it was uh like an like an Irish drinking song kind of thing called uh Drink Till You're Sober. <laughs> no, you say Irish drinking song and I obviously Hey <laughs> Whoa, my house got upgraded too. Oh, okay, mine? I mean see it. Yeah, go in. Mine's the same. What? Oh fuck, did they upgrade my goddamn cabin but not yours? Cause I paid for it? Oh, bullshit. Come look at this. That's not really ideal, actually. Dang. Yeah. Alright, we need to upgrade yours, then. We don't have to wait for that. We will soon. God, look at all these animals. Oh my god. <laughs> they won. Alright. I got you, I got you. I did not believe. Sorry, not sorry. Sorry, not sorry. Couldn't do it yesterday because I'm glad your little cat is bigger than mine. I hope you're. It's not actually bigger, it just looks that way because of uh, ego strength. You know, we need to redesign this big garden after this season. I like having this much space, but it can't be this big because we can't uh, prevent crows from getting into the middle of it. Yeah, I could have at least. Well, I mean, you could. I could have just, like, left a hole right in the middle, I guess, or something. Or in certain yeah, that, that might have worked. Yeah, I didn't think about that. I honestly thought that having crows around, scarecrows around it, would just kind of create like a border. Well, you see, it, it would have, except that birds can fly. Yeah, but I mean, why would you fly into the middle of all the things that scare you? That's just silly. Well, I mean, they only really care if they're within reach, I guess. Anyway, I'm going to convert some of the lower quality crops into seeds. Like, I think what I might do is, like, sell the gold ones and then, um, start, you know, uh, turn the silvers and normals into more seed stock so we can just save on cash. Because okay. we clearly need to save cash. We're still not millionaires as far as I can tell, so I'm not happy. Only until we've made enough money to buy the town and all go to the ground in front of them. Will I be content? You see, this is what makes me think you probably would have enjoyed the Jojo Cola uh, quest. Because it just turns absolutely everything into money. And it turns the town center into, uh, like, a Walmart. The, uh, the voice of the, uh, the medic. Ooh, money! Filthy lucre. Oh, he didn't have any good plants to grow. Oh man, I thought about those freaking strawberry seeds he had yesterday at the sale, but they were a hundred gold each. I thought, that, I thought that was ridiculous. Is there I don't know. Like... Uh, I think Jojo Mart sells them. Do they? Maybe. Do they grow? Are they, like, are they good? Or are they just like... I mean, what do you expect? They're seeds. I don't know. They probably do something. I figured since you went to Jojo Mart to get them, they'd be like... <laughs> cola seeds. They grow full cans of cola. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Brondo. It has what plants crave. Okay, so the seed maker does work. It's giving me about two to one. Of course, I have to sit here and babysit it a bit. Oh, wait, I only got one that time. That sucks. And scrambled eggs. I don't actually know where you go to buy stuff here. Maybe just the uh, front the cashier, I think. Yeah. Oh, that's not how our shopping works. Parchment seeds. Oh, they have the same thing that he does. Yeah. Except. What if they're open on Wednesdays, though? More expensive. Everything's like a little more expensive. It's not even like a deal. Yeah. You suck. Which is kind of a shitty, like, comparison in some ways, because you'd like to think that it's like, oh, no, you're you're choosing between, like, supporting the little guy or, you know, lower prices. If it's just like, no, it's just it's just bad. Like, all the way around, it's bad. That doesn't 
It's not as big a conundrum. Okay, apparently the quality of the seed you put into the seed maker determines how many you get back sometimes. No, not just the quality of the plant. Yeah. Okay, that makes sense. Kind of defeat your whole put the crappy ones in there strategy, though, I guess. Yeah, but then again, I mean, you could theoretically, you know, keep recycling until you get a gold or something. I don't know. No. You can still sometimes get two. We could make a pen for them. I mean, like, we really could redesign this place a bit to better suit our needs. I'm just gonna sell the rest of these. I don't feel like sitting there at the seed machine. It is garlic grow again, or is garlic a one and done? I believe it's a one and done thing. Okay, that's fine by me. It's amazing. I still didn't buy enough seed. If you can sneak back uh, and grab me four more, um, actually, no, I guess we don't need them. I'm going back in. There. Yeah, I'm good. Did you have anything in the? Hey, you, you got a. You got some stuff in the greenhouse, right? Yeah, there, it's all on uh, garlic right now. It's those two farmer dots. They're gay. Yeah, they smell like garlic all the time. Is that a gay thing? <laughs> what does it mean? <laughs> I heard gay people like vampires. No, but they like garlic. I don't remember what the last thing was, but I said garlic. I think it was like a plate. I think I want a hamburger. Well, it goes in almost anything. Yeah, it goes well with a lot of stuff. Like, I just want to say that that's what it was. I really want to make some uh, spaghetti and meatballs right now, but I don't have mm. spaghetti. I I don't have meatballs. I have. I think I may have sauce, but I don't have any meat actually that I could eat for so I couldn't even do that. So it basically just be spaghetti and stuff. That was terrible, but... Hey, I got a rare seed off of uh, what's her face out here. Really? The uh, gypsy lady. Oh, is she down below? Yeah, she's selling rare seeds though, which is the exciting bit. Ooh, maybe you should buy the one I now the one I got uh, grows in fall and takes all season to grow. All season, dang. Yeah, I think it grows a special plant. Uh, I wonder if you could put that in the seed machine. Hmm, maybe. Yeah, we should also, like, with future gardens, we should maybe try experimenting with, like, um, fertilizer. Oh, uh, yeah. Fall seeds. Yeah, so she's, she's got fall seeds here, which we could put in the greenhouse, I guess. Yeah. Wait, who are you talking to? Her, the same lady. Oh, do you see a rare seed there as well? Yeah, I went ahead and bought it. Yeah, you absolutely should. We want as many of those as we can get. She doesn't have a rare throw or anything, does she? Nope, I don't think so. Okay. I've killed so many slimes in this game. <laughs> Their slime is on your hands. Literally. I'm a slime murderer. The words just blend right together. And I don't know why recently. I've had like the strongest urge to go back and replay um, Breath of the Wild again. But I need I, I think I need longer before I can like really go back into it kinda of blind. It is a good game. 
Uh, it really fucking is. <laughs> Right up there with Super Mario Odyssey. Also an amazing game, yeah. Winner of the lineup is, uh, is uh, getting like boozed up twice a week. Well, no, I, I actually bought jelly. Uh, I'm gonna go get jelly because it's already kind of late and I'm already running behind. <laughs> Well, what's, what else is he going to do in the evening? What do you think he's got in there? A laptop? I think he's a little bit drunk. <laughs> what depressing thing have you to say to me now, Linus? I don't know. He might be starting to like you now. Oh, well, I can't talk to him because apparently I gave him the gift first. So. Yeah, I've got him up to two hearts. It's a slow process, which I guess is understandable. Hmm. You keep bringing me this jelly, and we'll be best friends for you know it. <laughs> I mean, obviously, giving people jelly is the way friendships are started in this world. <laughs> Would you like some delicious jams and jelly? Are you already in bed? Nope. I was down cutting trees and land. It wasn't ours. I have 411 wood. I guess I could technically, uh, potentially get my house upgraded then sometime. Yeah, we should basically focus on your house, I think. I think I'm more concerned right now with getting that mill built. Well, we can do that too. Because then we can turn flour into... or we can turn... Gold! Flour. <laughs> we can spin straw into gold! Machine, oh wait, I keep, I keep looking at my crafting inventory. That's not how it works. Nope. Bedtime. I have to walk so much further in my bed now. This is bullshit. There's a fucking bear in the way. Did you put the bear here? <laughs> no. Yes, you did. Do not <laughs> give me that shit. Your giant blue bear became sentient and moved throughout the day. This is not Five Nights at Freddy's. <laughs> <laughs> Animatronic bear. Okay. If you keep that up, I'm gonna start hiding my bears in your depart uh, your apartment. <laughs> Granny Evelyn wants me to bring her a leek for her husband. What's a leek? I forget. Is it a fish? It's uh, like an onion. Oh. I don't have it, though. Nope, don't think so. But, uh, I might be able to get you one nonetheless, because they occasionally grow down south. Oh, it's one of those wild plants, isn't it? No, I think you can grow them, too. Luckily, I remembered to close the uh, barn door. We thought we were so full. <laughs> I feel like any time a kid says, like, any time you start a phrase like, we used to think we were so cool, you're going to get a pretty cringy story in general. And I count myself strongly among those numbers. At recess in the elementary school, yeah, that sounds like, uh, you know, boy logic. I remember one day, it was like the best day ever because all the girls in my class got in trouble. I don't know how, it's just the girls, but they all got, uh... I don't know what it was called, kind of like time out or whatever. Yeah. Or they had to, they basically didn't get recess, but they had to stand for like for a while. Like next, next to the playground while we played. And, uh, yeah. So we were all just like, we basically just had a captive audience that was supposed to watch us. <laughs> hey girls, look at this. Check out how fast I can run. 
<laughs> Basically, that was it. You're wet yet? <laughs> Why are some of these patches not? Uh. Oh. Uh, they probably. I don't know, actually. Okay, I'm gonna go get some more wood. And you may want to go get the uh, mill started up. Yeah, I was just trying to think of the. Uh, wood probably, stone, and I'm guessing a lot. Oh, hey, uh, salmon berries have come back in. Ooh, I'm going north anyway, so I'll go yeah, you take north. I'm going south to collect wood anyway, so I'll collect them, all the ones down here. I mentioned Mario Odyssey. I want to go back and play that again, too, at some point. Damn, that was a good game. The ending was rather amazing, too. Oh, yeah. Which ending do you mean, though? You know, the whole ending with, like, him and... Like for a second there, I like you kind of think that Bowser and Mario are gonna like be, you know, reconciled and everything, and they're just kind of like go after Peach again. Yeah. Is it, is it on the moon or something? Like that? Yeah, because yeah. he's going to get married to her on the moon because yeah. why not? Why? Such a weird game. Really good, but very weird. Any of the places I'm trying to literally her sole means of income, I feel. What are you talking about? What else is she building? <laughs> Not for anyone else, it's just us. She does seem to have chosen a poor town to uh, work like that. I don't know, maybe she's got some side businesses. On the side. Just her and her black husband. Doing nothing out of the ordinary. Hello, Linus. Racist. <laughs> I'm not racist. That was a stereotype. There's a difference. A racist stereotype. Okay. Alright, I might be able to get a leak down here. I mean, I really did a good uh, job on all the trees down here. There's nothing left. You killed them all. Met that Lorax, just cut him right in half. <laughs> Finding a decent amount of salmon berries. That's yeah, same here. I'm about 26 at the moment, so yeah, we should have another a good harvest of them. I mean, and they may not even be worth turning into wine eventually. We may just want to hold on to them and use them as, uh, you know, food for dungeoneering and such. Yeah, they don't do an awful lot of that either. Though. 25. That's well, 25 energy, but only 10 health. So yeah, they're not great, but. Carrying this stupid copper pan around to mine for or to, to sift for gold and water every thing but like twice. I like a waste of my inventory. Yeah, maybe. But what can you do? You take this thing and throw it in the face of that guy that gave it to me. Oh, god damn, I was so eager to get rid of this goddamn copper pan of mine. Luckily, those stupid kids just took it. Mm -hmm. I should have a lot more wood. Uh, probably. At least high quality ones. I have no idea what they're used for, but. If you want to save them, we can save them. Yeah, I don't know. I just think they'll probably be useful for something at some point. 
but I don't admittedly have a clear idea. He made me a sweater out of duck feathers. Those gay farmers are crazy. <laughs> now, now, might be a little unfair to assume they're making duck feather sweaters just because they're gay. They could be crazy. Okay, I think I've got almost all the trees down south taken down. Actually, I may have all of them now. You are a monster. Same as me, actually. Well. World's greatest monster. Is this on my coffee cup? <laughs> World's greatest monster. Amon. Amon. Barbara Slim. I wish I could remember more of his lines. I can't remember what it was, but like Hermes had to like limbo like three inches off the ground or something. And oh yeah. He ended up doing it, but he couldn't get back up, and they had to like go on without him just because he was stuck. <laughs> okay, I'm checking the beach quick. Oh, already been this way. <laughs> gay guys deforested the entire place. <laughs> what do the gays have against trees? <laughs> I thought they liked wood. <laughs> now, honey, you can't keep making jokes like that. It's not really woke. <laughs> it's not woke. <laughs> Yeah, that's what I was going for. Did you ever find that leak? No, I did not. There were no leaks growing. It's been patched up, black seal on everything. No leaks. <sighs> if you need a... Well, I was gonna say, if you need um, uh, mining experience, you can probably go to the quarry quick and grab a few quick uh, minerals. I did that already, actually. Uh huh. I only grabbed like three or four, and it was only the ones that had potential ore. I, mean, I didn't. I didn't. Yeah, that's the smart right. way to do it. All right, I got three hundred and sixty-one more uh, wood. Ugh. Why in the world would game dev talk to me have an update to you? What could they possibly be that in that game? After all these... Battle Royales? <laughs> that would be insane. That would be the kind of thing that'd be easy to add, though. In a game dev game, though? Yeah. And I mean, like, as an option for game design. Oh, I thought you meant like... <laughs> okay, yeah, that makes more sense. <laughs> I mean, technically, game development can be kind of seen as a sort of a battle royale situation, but... I suppose. Looks like our bees are making honey. I've been picking it up every now and then, so we probably have been getting some. Well, okay. Maybe that's what it is. Because I just noticed, like, this one middle beehive has, like, a honeycomb in it, and all the two on the outside have nothing in them at all. They're just eight so I don't know. Hmm. I don't know what that means. Portents of Doom. I wish we had some torches in the, uh, in the greenhouse. It's dark. Uh, can you put torches down in there? I don't know. Worth a shot. If we had any torches. Mm, we should have a few. One wood, two sap. And we, we have torches sitting around, I'm sure. Hold on. Look in the green chest. Oh, God, there's 133 in there. Yeah, see? <laughs> we got food not, at home! I didn't make that many torches, okay? That was... That had to no, be I've, I've been picking them up obsessively down in the mine. Yeah, that's, like, that's the whole we have food at home speech. I hated that speech. Oh, 
it's lit up on the outside, but not on the inside. Because I can't really... I mean, I guess I couldn't really could put a torch in the middle of the yard, but that seems weird. Okay, bedtime. Oh. Yeah, lock up all the freaking monsters. And I walk all the way over to my bed. God damn it. <laughs> my house is so big. Actually, what I really think we should do if we had the option was get rid of my cabin entirely and uh, just have, move all the stuff into your house and just have both of us use that one. <laughs>